Esme's going, well, Esme went down for a nap. We purchased a vacuum and a shoe rack because those were like the top two things that we really needed. Just because we also are in the process of moving, we've only been in this apartment for two months now. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much, we're just like playing catch up, things like that. So the shoe rack is, I'm doing the shoe rack right now while the vacuum's charging. Josh just went to work, we were like eight, went to Walmart and then we went separate ways. He went to work, I came back to the apartment because there's just a lot that has to get done. <laughs> This is the shoe rack, right? And this is what they like look like they advertise. I mean, it's not bad, but Josh has some big feet. So I definitely do feel like this is not gonna work for us. Okay, this is a perfect example of don't judge a book by its cover because it looks so cute. Josh is a size 13, I think. 13 or 14. I don't know. Some of them are I don't know. Some are 14, some are 13. I don't know. But he does have some big feet compared to mine, so I look at his shoes like they're like cloud shoes, but it's so cute. And I think for now, definitely the one is going to do is so good because these are literally all of our shoes that are down here for the season. But I think eventually, like, we'll get to. My kitchen looks like a mess, guys. Like, I promise it's not going <laughs> to look like this for much longer. All right, so long story short... We are obviously in prep mode for baby number two. We just have to get everything ready. And honestly, that's like what's been really getting pushed back is just getting everything ready. We just moved, so yes. And then we both work full-time jobs. It's like chaotic right now. But I like to record this part of my pregnancies. I think that this is like the most funnest part because it's like you guys get to come along on the journey of us prepping to get ready for baby number two i'm saying baby number two because i'm not sure if josh did want to announce the gender or not i kind of want to keep it a secret for a little bit but i literally only have like a couple more weeks left so i'm not sure how much longer until you guys have to keep hearing baby number two but yes and then as you guys know we saved esme's name until she was born so we're definitely going to be saving baby number two's name until they are born this looks crazy right now and it's making me feel so anxious, but it's gonna get done today, I promise.
just finishing editing this video and then I realized I never actually recorded an official outro for this video however <laughs> the last thing that I had to do on my list was just vacuum my room and Esme actually woke up from a two-hour nap as soon as I was done rinsing off everything for baby number two getting the bathroom all situated so I didn't really have time to set up the camera and all that stuff but vacuuming is done it's off my list now so yes I feel like this is such a crazy video just because we're coming back. As you guys can tell, we already moved. And now we're talking about baby number two being on the way. But that is just kind of what has happened from when I have last seen you guys. We just had Ez. We were trying to adapt to be parents. And within this last year, we've just been enjoying being parents and balancing out our schedules. We both work full-time jobs. So that is just pretty much chaotic and then to do social media on the side is just another thing i do enjoy it i feel like on days where i do record i have a whole lot more accountability and i try to get as much done i hope you guys like this video and if you guys do like videos like this make sure you guys comment that down below so at least i know what you guys are into what you're not into so if you like this video make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to stay along for our journey